Hey everybody, it's Sebak7 and welcome back to more Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D and today I'm bringing you another bonus episode and yeah, this time around we're gonna do a side quest so yeah, it's not gonna be like um, a mini game li uh, like in the last episode no, we're actually gonna do a side quest and um, from this side quest we're gonna obtain another empty bottle yeah, I know, it's not not really that important uh, to complete the game because as I as you saw I, I, I had like three empty bottles throughout the main storyline and this one is kind of this last one is kind of tricky to get but if you're trying to complete the game with a hundred percent and get all the stuff well you'll have to get through this and what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna try to capture all the 10 big posts that are in Iral Field. So if you guys remember during my main let's play, during my main storyline, you know, we, we end up visiting uh, the ghost shop right here in Iral Castle Town. So you need to be as Adult Link and right here as you see there's this guy right over there. You see? And uh, he, he tells you that he's trying to get bows and all that stuff so um, yeah you need empty bottles to um, to collect uh, the the bows and then sell them to him uh, it's kind of hilarious to be honest because you need empty bottles to get the bows and in the end what you're gonna get is another empty bottle <laughs> anyway uh, yeah <laughs> so I have three empty bottles as I told you and I'm gonna call a bone right away here because yeah having a Pona for this side quest is a lot easier and uh, yeah you're gonna ride a Pona you have to find all the 10 uh, big bows and then use the bow and kill them and capture them inside the um, an empty bottle so there's gotta be one right here there we go that's the first one, and it can be found right next to the entrance of Iron Castle. And there we go. So then you talk to the bow, and if you have an empty bottle, you can get it. And that's the first one. So then we have the second one, and the second one, if I yeah, if I recall, is around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Come on, Epona! No, oh, I missed that one. Okay, but yeah, that's the place. So, um, as you can see, it's it seems it's not really that hard, but it can get tricky. Anyway, let's try it once again. Oh, come on! No! Oh man, I messed that up once again. And I'm wasting a lot of arrows. Oh man, alright. Let's try it once again. So yeah, as you can see, this can get a little tricky if you miss a lot of... Yeah, if you miss a lot, it can get tricky. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I've wasted a bunch of arrows with this one. Anyway, that's the second big bow you get. And now, where's the third one? I think it's somewhere over there. Yeah, I guess it's somewhere over here. Yeah, you need to get next to one of these butchers and the guy must appear somewhere. Oh, there he goes. No, 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 no. Oh man, and I wasted another arrow. So yeah. Let's see if we manage to do this. So, as I told you, it's not really a big deal to get this empty bottle. But if you train for an 100% an save file, so, well, you'll have to do it. And that's it. We got our third bow so since I just have 
three empty bottles for now, I'll have to get back to the ghost shop and sell all of these pools right away. And that's what I'm gonna do it. Uh, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do, so... Here we go. Let's get back to Iron Castle. And there we go, so... Come on, let's get down, alright. So, let's get back to Iron Castle Town and to the ghost shop. To be more precise, and... Come on, Link. Here we go. Okay. Uh, yeah, I have bows. There we go. So yeah, he actually gets you money and he gets you 100 points for each bow. And as you can see, he tells you that as soon as you get a uh, thousand points, he'll give you something very special. And that's gonna be the empty bottle, actually. So now that we're done with that, I guess we can get back to Hyrule Field. So, alright, we're back here. Okay, so Epona is right here, so let's ride. Now that I think about it, maybe I should change my tunic. I really love the current tunic, but yeah, maybe I should change it. Let's see if we can. Yeah, here we go. I'm gonna change to the Zora tunic to be kind of different, you know. Because yeah, I keep using the <laughs> Goron tunic throughout the game and uh, I haven't used the Zora tunic too that much to be honest and I, I, I think that all the tunics are, are great but I kind of prefer the Goron tunic a little more so anyway I'm kind of rambling here <laughs> so the next one you wanna go where do you wanna go I guess you have to go right to like if you were going to Gerudo's Valley and there he is, there he is, oh man, I missed him, oh, okay. So yeah, right here, next to, yeah, next to this tree. There we go, there we go, come on, come on, oh man, that's gonna be a tricky one. Yeah, cause he keeps, yeah, he, he disappears a, 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 lot fa a, a lot faster than, than I thought, to be honest. Here we go, so let's try this once again. Oh man, I missed this! Oh, what's so close? Okay. Okay, so let's try it once again. No, oh, not again! I'm wasting a lot of arrows with this. There we go. So actually guys, don't run. It's better not to run, to be honest. Otherwise, you're gonna mess that up like I did. Okay, so don't run with Epona. When you're near this place, don't run at all. Just keep... Yeah, just keep moving with a normal pace. It's... Yeah, it's safer, to be honest. Anyway, the fifth one is right here. See, the guy just disappeared right there. So, you need to get here. Oh, come on. He disappeared once again. Oh, whoa, whoa, there he goes. Okay, so let's try this once again.
Oh man, I just got one arrow left. Yeah, it seems I'm not gonna be able to do this, guys. So I'm gonna cut the video right here. I'm gonna buy a bunch of arrows and I'll be back to you to continue this side quest. Okay, guys, and I'm back with a bunch of arrows. So yeah, let's see if I can do this this time. Okay, so where is he? Hmm, he's not appearing? That's strange. Oh, whoa, there he goes. Oh man, okay. So remember, try not to run too much. Try to be cool about this. So, oh man, I'm getting really annoyed right now. Because <laughs> I'm trying to do this the fastest way possible, but... I don't get it. Yes, finally! Oh man, that was one tricky. It was really tricky. Okay, we got him. Alright. So now let's see if we can get the sixth, uh, the sixth one. And the sixth one is around here. Yeah, it's somewhere around here. If I recall. There's this tree right here. And it's gotta be somewhere here. I think. Or is it over there? Hmm. I don't know. Oh. Maybe it's over here. Oh, there he goes, there he goes. Yes, we did it. So that's it, that's the sixth one. So yeah, you need to be kind of near the, the entrance of Kokiri Forest and all that stuff. And yeah, that's the sixth one. So we're gonna make a little edit and we're gonna get back to the ghost shop already. Here we go, guys. Okay, and here we are in the ghost shop. So let's... Let's sell the remaining re uh, the remaining big bows we have here. And that's another one. So yeah, we get a lot of money from this. So if you need uh, some extra money, I don't know, even during the main storyline, maybe you could pull this off, to be honest. And like that, you'll get a lot of rupees and you'll get another empty bottle to be honest i didn't miss uh, the um yeah the the fourth empty bottle didn't make uh, too much of a different uh, difference for me during the storyline but yeah uh, it might help a lot of people anyway i'm just rumbling here so let's keep moving and we're gonna get the four, remo er, four remaining ones. So yeah, we're aiming for the seventh pole now. So here we go, guys. Okay, so here we go. And now we're going for... I guess we actually need to get, like, to the same spot we were. Because, yeah, I think the, the other... Pole is yeah, is really next to the place we found the the six ones. So um, we need to get to. Oh yeah, so we need to get right over there. Oh, you see, there he is. Okay. Oh man. I almost got him. Yeah. So he's right here, guys. Oh wait, I think this is actually another one, yeah, I guess there's, uh, yeah, I guess there's one here, I forgot about. There he is. So you see, there's one here. And that's another one, the one we see prior to that one, to, to this one. So yeah, 
This is gonna be the seventh, the other one's gonna be the eighth, and yeah. Alright, so let's see if we manage to get him to appear once again. Come on, where are you? Hopefully I'm doing this so you guys can know where they are. Otherwise, it will take a lot of time to be honest. Come on. W why is not appearing? I don't know. Okay, let's try it once again. Okay, so here we go. No, oh man, so close, so really close. Oh, okay. Yes, we did it. All right. So that's it for the seventh one. All right, there we go. And now let's go to the eighth one. And we actually got to cross him, as you saw right there. So you need to get here to this kind of road, you see. And there's gonna be like a boulder right here, this boulder. And that should be the, yeah, that should be your point of reference to know where to find him. So just get by this boulder right here, and there we go. Oh man, now oh, I'm missing this. There we go, let's start once again. Alright, and we did it. So that's it for the 8th one. The ninth one could be found... Ooh. Now let me think about it, where can we find the ninth one? Oh, I know, you need to get... You keep moving through this path, you know. And you should end up right next to the Lumen Ranch. And there's these things, uh, there, uh, there's this thing right here, this kind of V-shape wall, you see. And the pole should appear somewhere around here. Yeah, I can hear the ghosts laughing but I can't find him but I know he's here somewhere oh there he is there he is oh man there I saw him okay okay I got this guys There we go, and that's it for the ninth one. Okay, so you really need to be, yeah, I don't know if you need to be right where I was, but yeah, it seems to appear somewhere right there. So um, that's it, that's the ninth one, and I guess I'm gonna make another little cut right here. We're gonna sell all the um, these free posts to the um, ghost shop honor. And yeah, I'll get back to you right away, guys. Okay, and now let's head to the last big bow, the tenth one. And to find him, you actually need to get right here to this spot near Kakariko Village. As you can see, there's this kind of... It's not a bridge, you know, but yeah... 
this place right here and the ghost should appear somewhere oh there he goes okay then we did it guys that's it that's the final one that's the, the last remaining big bow and now time to get back to the ghost shop and with this we'll end the big bow side quest and we're gonna get another empty bottle really cool so as you can see this side quest might seem easy at first sight but it isn't because yeah you have to defeat all 10 big bows but they keep moving and it's really annoying to try to eat them and they keep uh, yeah they keep disappearing right uh, right in front of your nose but anyway yeah it may take some practice uh, uh, so here I am and let me just deliver the last big bow to this guy right here here we go and if you okay okay wait a minute whoa you have earned a thousand points young man you are a genuine ghost hunter is that what you expect me to say <laughs> because of you I have extra inventory of big posts so this will be the last time I can buy one of these ghosts you're thinking about what I promised pull the app and when you earned a thousand points huh <laughs> don't worry I didn't forget just take this and there we go as I promised guys, that's it, we obtain another empty bottle and this is it, this is pretty much it. So yeah, we completed this side quest and yeah, as I told you, it's not really a piece of cake as it might seem. Uh, but yeah, if you, you're aiming for 100% you'll have to do this side quest. Anyway that's it for this episode i think yeah i think that's gonna be it for this episode hope you guys enjoyed this video it was yeah it was kind of funny but at the same time it was kind of um and uh, kind of frustrating because you really yeah i was trying to get all the ghosts the the fastest way possible but they were yeah they kept on moving and running away from me but it was really curious the, as you can see I, 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 there's a lot of stuff in this game even after completing the main storyline there's a lot of stuff to do uh, I really like I really like that aspect about this game to be honest anyway that's it for this episode hope you guys enjoyed if you did don't forget to like the video add it to your favorites you can always leave me your comments in the comment section below I really appreciate all this all the support you guys can give me because yeah it really means a lot to me and it helps the channel uh, a ton to be honest yeah it, it helps the channel a lot and yeah you can also follow me on Twitter like me on Facebook all the links are gonna be in the description so that's it guys thanks for watching